Danila Lekandrovich, in Russian, 1261, the 4th of March 1303 was the youngest son of Alexander Nevsky and forefather of all the Grand Princes of Moscow. Prince Daniel of Moscow was the fourth and youngest son of Saint Prince Alexander Nevsky, famous in the history of the Russian state and the Russian Orthodox Church, and his second wife, Princess Vasa. Daniel was born in 1261 in Vladimir, the capital of the great Vladimir's Isdal Principality. One of the most junior princes in the House of Rurik, Daniel is thought to have been named after his celebrated relative, Daniel of Galicia. His father died when he was only two years old. Of his father's patrimonies, he received the least valuable, Moscow. When he was a child, the tiny principality was being governed by tons, deputies, appointed by his paternal uncle, Grand Prince Yaroslav III. Daniel took part in his brothers, Dmitri of Preslav and Andrei of Goroditz struggle for the right to govern Vladimir and Novgorod, respectively. After Dmitri's death in 1294, Daniel made an alliance with Mikhail of Tver and Ivan of Preslavl against Andrei of Goroditz of Novgorod. Daniel's participation in the struggle for Novgorod in 1296 indicated Moscow's increasing political influence. Constantine, the Prince of Ryazin, tried to capture the Moscow lands with the help of a Mongol force. Prince Daniel defeated it near Pruslavl. This was a first victory over the Tatars, though not a tremendous victory, but it was noteworthy as a first push towards freedom. In 1300, he imprisoned the ruler of the Ryazan Principality by some ruse, as the chronicle says. To secure his release, the prisoner ceded to Daniel his fortress of Kolomna. It was an important acquisition as now Daniel controlled all the length of the Moskva River. In 1302 his childless nephew and ally, Ivan of Preslavl, bequeathed to Daniel all his lands, including Preslavl Zelensky. During the Mongol occupation and internecine wars among the Rus princes, Daniel created peace in Moscow without bloodshed. During thirty years of ruling Daniel participated in battles only once, according to legend. Daniel was popular and respected by his subjects for his meekness, humility and peacefulness. Daniel has been credited with founding the first Moscow monasteries, dedicated to the Lord's Epiphany and to Saint Daniel. On the right bank of the Moskva River, at a distance of five miles from the Moscow Kremlin not later than in 1282 he founded the first monastery with the wooden church of Street. Daniel's Tylite now it is the Danilov Monastery. At the age of 42 on the 17th, 4th in old style, of March in 1303 Street, Daniel died. Before his death he became a monk and, according to his will, was buried in the cemetery of the street. Daniel Monastery. He was canonized by the Russian Orthodox Church in 1652.